My next step is to add a graphics laser projector. This will project onto the upstage center screen. I will first add a new RGB projector to my scene. Next, I need to position the projector downstage center right about where my center moving headlights are located. Once in position, I will rotate the projector so that the red line coming out of the projector aperture is pointing right at the center of my screen. Now that the projector is in its physical location, first thing I want to do is rename this projector so that it's easier to find in my Objects tab. Once renamed, I will need to set it to communicate with Beyond the same way I did with the two atmospheric projectors. In order to do this, I will need to set this projector as being active. Once set, the graphic zone that we had previously had was Channel 1 in Beyond, so I need to set the Laser Source and Realizer to Laser Source 1. I will switch over to Beyond, go to Settings, Projector Zones, select Main Graphics as my zone, go to the Advanced tab, and confirm that the fixture is set to number 1. Now we're ready for the fun part. Let's start getting some projections happening. First thing I need to do is turn on the Visualization option in Pangolin Beyond. I do this by going up to View and enable visualizations via external software. A dialog indicating that the fixture numbers can be set in the advanced view for the zones comes up. Just hit OK. With Beyond and Realizer side by side and my main zone dialog open, I will enable the zone test pattern for the main graphic zone. I can see that the image is skewed in my projection screen. I will fix this by adjusting the geometric correction. 